Welcome to Prototyping 2. I'm your instructor, Mark Bonasso. I teach in the Visual Communications Department for the User Experience Design degree. Uh, the prerequisite for this class is Prototyping 1, which is UX UI 1471. And in that class, you were first introduced to the goal directed design process, which is a user centered design process explained in the book About Face by Alan Cooper. That design process was used as a framework to introduce you to the different levels and methods of prototyping that have happened throughout the design process, uh, such as sketching, digital wireframing, low fidelity interactive prototyping. In prototyping two, you will become a mobile prototyping machine. In other words, get ready for lots of practice. This course is broken down into several competencies. I'm just going to do a quick run through to give you the gist of what those competencies are. So you have a roadmap for prototyping two. Competency one, um, you're gonna start right off into detailed digital wireframing, mocking up mobile screen flows for an existing mobile app. Uh, in competency two, you'll jump right back into Envision, the program that you were introduced to in prototyping one, and you'll make your screen flows interactive. You'll also get a chance to get your feet wet with another online prototyping tool called UX Pin. Then in competency three, you'll create what we're calling a visual vocabulary prototyping file that will assist you in the more rapid creation of prototypes in future assignments in this course. In competency four, it's time to create something new. You'll choose from a list of mobile app ideas to run with for competency four and five. You'll use the goal-directed design process to start fleshing out this idea. You'll develop a lo-fi interactive prototype for this app concept and you'll run it through a first round of user testing. And moving into the final competency, number five, you'll be implementing the necessary changes that you receive from your user testing feedback from project four. Then you'll create a high fidelity interactive prototype of your app concept and take it through a second round of user testing to further refine your app concept uh, idea. So that's pretty much it for the roadmap for prototyping two. I think you'll be having so much fun in this class that you'll forget that you're in school. Hope you enjoy the class.